Tonight we're at the Kidney Ball. It's the best black tie event in Detroit, and it always is. A lot of sweat, tears, blood um, goes into this night, and we think this is the best event in the city. The Kidney Ball is an opportunity for people to get together and raise money for the National Kidney Foundation of Michigan. There's an incredible auction going on tonight, uh, both silent and live, some of the unique items that you can't find anywhere else. 90 cents of every single dollar goes to programs that help save people's lives. We're all dressed in the 20s style. We've, we've added a little something different this year to just put a little extra pizzazz in the night. Everybody looks so wonderful in their dresses and all of the feathers, and I just look forward to tonight. Look forward to just meeting a lot of new people and just having a lot of fun. What I'm lo looking forward to the most is raising as much money as we possibly can to help the people who need it. It's a great night and it is a fantastic cause that so many people are affected by. I want everyone to bid high and bid often, and to uh, bid until it hurts, and then bid one more time. Tonight our goal is to raise $500,000, and we raise it for our programs and services, but almost specifically for our prevention programs. The money here raised by the Kidney Foundation goes to everything that you can imagine. The emergency funds are funded through events like this, the fellowship programs are funded through events like this, and the important education programs and health prevention come through events like this. I love it that all of the dollars stay right here in Michigan, that we help people with kidney disease, and we help prevent kidney disease. There are a lot of folks that have kidney problems, and it keeps growing, and almost a million people in the state of Michigan have kidney disease. If we can raise awareness with events like the Kidney Ball tonight, we can help people who are at high risk, such as my dad, to actually not go down that road to dialysis. My father died in 1980 from kidney disease, so I try to keep the torch going. We always hear from one of the children who have been impacted by kidney disease and by the money that's raised here. With the money we raise tonight, we'll be able to send a lot of kids to camp this summer where they can be a kid and go on the canoes and be able to do the things that most kids uh, take for granted. One of the things I'm looking forward to is, is uh, the story of uh, the Duraskovich family and I think it'll be wonderful to see the family uh, up on stage and, and being able to share their story with the room. My name is Ava and I have two sisters, Maddie and Sylvia, and both of them have kidney disease. So I decided that I was going to make a team for the kidney walk and in total we raised about $5,000 with the help of all of our family and friends. I am a transplant recipient. Um, I've had three kidney transplants and I love coming to events like this so people can see the results of what's going on with their fundraising that they can look at people like myself and say, I've made a difference. I have got many, many patients that I have cared for, and I have seen firsthand the difference that the foundation can make in taking care of these patients. I'm just so fortunate to be here to help make a difference, because everybody that's in the room tonight, that's exactly what they're gonna do. They're gonna have a chance to save lives. We can stop this, but we need to raise the dollars, we need to get the word out, we need to show people how they can prevent kidney disease. Thank you to Ava and all the other people who donate for research for kidney disease.